boys soccer regular season winding down, Naperville North can clinch the DVC championship with a win on the road at Neuqua Valley. The two teams met in the sectional championship a year ago, with the Huskies winning 3-0. Neuqua riding a 10-game winning streak, North on an 11-game win streak. Opening minutes of the game, Billy Hinatis taps the pass to TJ Fenton. Fenton powers through the defense, whirls and fires towards the net, but the shot stays wide. Nequa the aggressors early. Ten minutes into the game, David Kuhn lofts a pass that just evades the head of Jason Benjamin, but it deflects off Cesar Resendez and Benjamin kicks it in. Wildcats strike first for the 1-0 lead. A few minutes later, Daniel Costi taps a pass to Amish Gupta, whose shot is deflected by Colin Iverson, slowing the ball to allow Tommy Welch to snag it out of the air. Huskies on the offensive, Jack Berry on the throw-in, goalie Dylan Soto taps it out. Ty Conrad has a chance, but a great job by Soto to get back in position to make the save. Just over 20 minutes to play, Jack Berry always dangerous with the throw-in, heaves it perfectly to set up 6'4 Colin Iverson for the equalizer. A few minutes later, Barry again with a throw-in opportunity. The captain gets plenty of air under it again. Iverson gets a head on it, and Ethan Harvey tacks it down to tap in the go-ahead goal. Huskies take a 2-1 lead and make it stand, winning the game, the DBC title, and their 12th game in a row. We could see a rematch of this one next weekend in the Lockport Regional Final. Even when we're down, we know, I mean, it's been pretty few times this year, but we're confident. We know that once we, once we get that first goal, it's going to come, and we're a strong unit, we play together, and um, it's great to get some a competitive game right before the playoffs starting, and we could potentially see this, that team next week in the regional final, so it's good to see what they have this year, and uh, it was fun. It was a great competitive game out there. Uh, there's definitely, I think there's a lot more pressure. I feel like we're expected, we're ranked higher going in, I think, than we were last year. I feel like we're expected to do better, but... You know what? We're a team. We fight for each other. This is a this is a strong team, and we played them last year, and they were uh, still a very strong team. And you know, we have a lot to learn, and uh, I guess we can only uh, take good things from this game. <laughs> Sometimes it's frustrating how much we practice the thrones, but like it definitely pays off. Like it's just amazing. We don't try and rob rah too much when we when we don't need to. We know that we gotta get our jobs done. We've been through it, so we try and keep our composure each game. We know like last year we had a two rough games in the regional and that almost uh, slipped us up. So like really, that's been a focus this year is to try and take each each game as as it is a important one. Yeah, it's great to be back at the time of the year. Obviously, playoffs are what we live for. Like that's what we were playing out here for. So uh, still take it one game at a time, though. I think you got to win seven games to win state. So it's 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 a long journey. So we'll take it one step at a time. But we definitely have the tools to hopefully make a long playoff run like we did last year.